Hey y'all, it's your girl Suzette with Crafting with Susie coming to you today with a new unboxing from Diamond Art Club. But before I get into all of that, if you are new to my channel and you like what you see, please hit the like button. Don't forget to leave a comment and subscribe. Also hit that notification below so you're notified of when I do my next upload here on YouTube. I also put notification information on my Instagram page. I'll be sure to put that link below. If you've been back to see me several times, thank you so much for your support. I love reading your words of encouragement. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Alrighty guys, so <clears throat> if you watched my last car vlog, episode 28, I talked about how I've already failed at my detox. <laughs> from diamond painting purchases. <sighs> mm. So, I did buy one. Well, I bought two. But I always buy two uh, because I don't want to pay the shipping. So, I'd rather just go ahead and get two diamond paintings. But anywho, this is the newest one that I purchased. Today is November 4th. Um... It was a new release from last week, and I just had to have it. I just had to have it. So, you can already tell by the blue that this is a square, and I just am not going to have you guys wait any longer, but it's coral. Isn't she pretty? So this one is a 56 by 56 centimeter and her name for the artist is Sarah Mustafa. I said that right, Mustafa. This is a square and you always know it's a square because it comes with the blue box, the blue ribbon around it and it says it right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this started. Oh, y'all, I got a problem, but that's okay. We're going we gonna to get through it. We are going to get through it, I promise. So I saw this one, and I actually even left a comment telling them I don't know why they continue to tempt me. It is just so awesome. Um, Diamond Art Club, they always give you a, a way to save on your painting. So when you order from them, you get a little 15% off coupon inside of the box. It's like attached to your uh, postal delivery and it's on the inside. There's also the scan code here. And on the inside of the box, there's also, I believe, a 10% off thank you coupon. So let's go ahead and open this one up, see what we got. No, um, there's no ticket. There's no golden ticket. So this is the little sticker that I always put in my book. If you would like, you can put it on your diamond painting box so you can know what it is faster. I just use a label maker. This is your standard kit from Diamond Art Club. You get two plates of heart-shaped wax. With the squares, you get the really nice metal needle nose tweezers. You get a um, diamond painting pen, and it comes with a four-placer. You get the standard tray, and you get a lot of bags. They give you a lot of these little bags. Because some people kit up with the bags. I usually use a storage container. You have your nice dust bag with their name on it here. And Diamond Art Club, of course, is known for their canvases and how soft they are and the fact that they um, actually lay out very quickly you don't have to put it under anything heavy like a mattress or books or anything so i just want to make sure i'm rolling her okay so let's go ahead and unroll her oh yes it is so glittery oh she's the perfect size she's the perfect size let me move this so let me go ahead and flatten her out 
Y'all cannot tell. This is so pretty. Her face is awesome. The rendering is awesome. And I really got it because she wasn't like huge. She's a really nice size. Um, this is where, for the step-by-step, -step, the additional 10% coupon is in the back there that you can use for a thank you. Okay, and this is the schematic. There's 42 colors here. And these are perforated, so if you use a storage container like I do, you could just take these stickers off and add them onto your storage containers. It looks like there is four ABs, so any number that's gonna be below 150 is gonna be an Aurora Borealis drill. And those are the drills that have the extra coating so you get that iridescent look to them. This is nice. Uh, I also put this one in my little diamond painting journal. You have your start date, your finish date, and you have all the artist information and the size of the diamond painting. She is pretty. This is a beautiful mermaid. Okay, so give me a second. Let me just help this out because I'm on camera. So I'm just gonna roll it back just a little bit. And this is cord blue, of course, everyone mostly knows that is what diamond art club uses so it is okay for you to roll it back to encourage it to lay flat for you can y'all see it can y'all see her tail okay good i just want to make uh, that's i really want you guys to see her tail so there is always two schematics also on the painting there is going to be one in the top left and also in the bottom right. It has their um, marketing at the top, Do What Makes You Sparkle, Diamond Art Club. And I'm not going to pull back the plastic. You don't have to, but it's really for the stickiness to check it. They are normally right on point with that the adhesive is very sticky so your drills don't pop or come off of your diamond painting so you don't you should not need to seal it i'm gonna show you guys the colors i'll make sure i do a speed through of these to show you the colors let's see here one second I saw Diamonds and Washi do an unboxing of this, and I really wanted to actually see the unboxing, so you can check out her video also. I just thought it was a gorgeous painting. Her holding uh, the seashell in her hands, and then she has one in her hair, and the little starfish. Her tail is amazing. There is the coral down here at the at the very bottom and we're going to check out to see what those ABs are so you're going to get a little ASMR here so it looks like there is a blue a green and orange and of course the infamous 141 which is white uh, there is 310, but I don't think it's going to be a lot of 310, y'all. Uh, I see two little baggies of it. I don't think it's going to be a lot of 310. I think uh, because it's only, from what I can see, in a few areas, a few small areas, that they had the 310. Let me move her over. I just wanted to make sure you guys were able to see her tail because I thought it was so cute. These are very pretty colors. There's a lot of blues. Uh, mauves. It's so hard to find the, <laughs> the ABs when you're looking for them. So let me go ahead and show you guys really quickly the colors and then we'll go over the ABs. We'll do it that way.
guys. So it looks like the ABs are going to be sprinkled within the painting. There wasn't too many in the baggies. So um, I'll go ahead and show you what I saw. This one is 132. And that one was number three. So that's down here in the starfish. There's a little sprinkles in the coral here. And okay, and along here too. So they're mostly in the starfish and the coral and there's a little bit here. Um, the other one was the yellow which is this one, 129. And 129 is number two. Let's see, okay, and that's highlighted in her shoulder, her face, there's a little bit, and on her elbows. So that's where I see the twos, her shoulder, her elbows, and then right here on her cheekbone, the next one, did I miss it? Uh-oh. Sorry guys, oh, okay. So the next one is the 141, and that's the white. which is this here, there's a nice amount in here. So that one is number four. And number four is, I see some here, down here where she's turning into the mermaid. And there's some sprinkled up in here. I think this is a necklace that's on her. Is that a necklace? Whoops. Yeah, that looks like a necklace here that's on her. Also in this seashell here in her hair. And do I see any anywhere? There's got to be a whole bunch more. Okay, yeah, they're all in the fishtail here. Because that's a lot of ABs. Yeah, and they're in her tail. They're in her tail. So that's where most of them are. They're, yeah, they're going to be all in her tail. And then the last one was number one, which was the blue. Let me see if I can find that one. I didn't even see it when I was going through it. So did I miss it? Let me find the blue. Sorry, guys. No, nope, that's not it. Oh, okay, here we go. So there's a nice amount of the blue also, which is this one, that's a nice amount. That's quite a bit, that's nice. And that's number 101. That's pretty, can y'all see that? I always get worried that you guys can't see it. So number one, yeah, it's all in her tail, all in her tail here, underneath, and I keep saying tail, but what is this? The body of the mermaid? <laughs> the body of the mermaid and then in her tail. So the white and the blue are gonna be in both those areas. I'm happy with the ABs. Um, I probably, oh, she, thank goodness. She has them, the blue is in the uh, seashell in her hair also. Okay, that's good. Because I was going to say, I was going to probably add some more there. But um, it's not necessary. It's already there. <clears throat> if you guys can hear that, that's my neighbor's dog barking outside. So, yes. I think she is absolutely gorgeous. Um, of course, she is a newer release so she's still available on the diamond art club website i'll turn her this way also so you guys can have a better look i know sometimes people ask me that so 
This is here at the bottom, just so you guys can have a better look. And then there you go. I think she's nice. I think she's pretty. I had to have it. I mean, at least that's what I'm saying to myself in my brain. Did I really have to have it? Probably not. But I didn't want it to sell out. I didn't want to miss it and then regret the fact that I didn't get it. So let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you actually chose this one from the new releases. If you guys stayed all the way to the end, thank you so very much for watching. Please leave me a mermaid emoji in the comment section. And you all remember to stay beautiful and to stay blessed. Bye.